I'm Dave Simmons on Radio 1. This is the Paul Butterfield Band, Louisiana Flood, with a fantastic vocal, really fantastic, from uh, Ronnie Barron. <laughs> Soul for Ronnie Barron from Algiers, Louisiana, and uh, Louisiana Flood with the Paul Butterfield Band. He used to be on the road with Dr. John the Night Tripper, and Mac Rebernack helped write that uh, number. It's on the new Bearsville album featuring the Paul Butterfield Band, and uh, the album is called It All Comes Back, and the number is Bearsville K45517. Bearsville K45517. Okay, the purists will say it isn't true soul, but I mean, who cares? You know, it's got the right R&B feel, and uh, Ronnie Barron's got his voice and his soul in the right place. Nine minutes to six, and this is the spot that we call... And meanwhile, back in the States... Yes, indeed, get the DJ on the line. And this week, brothers and sisters, wherever you may be in the United Kingdom or wherever else, my guest is uh, Mad Bob McKee from Atlanta, Georgia. There are two guys I call at uh, WAOK, the number one soul station catering for the black community of Atlanta, Georgia. Burke Johnson, who's the program manager, and he's sort of, he's sort of straight, you know, and he's cool, and I stayed at his place, and I went to bed early, and uh, a couple of nights later, I stayed with somebody else who's the morning man there, bad, bad Bob McKee, and, uh, hell, we didn't get to bed until about five or six in the morning every night when 
I was with him saying, see what he's like. It's the exclusive feature of the Dave Simmons Show where every week I ring a different American radio station. There are almost 7,000 radio stations in America, but there are 150 that play nothing but soul. And I pick out half a dozen or so, maybe a dozen now we've reduced it to, out of the 20 I used to call, that I can count on regularly each week. A G DJ will be there when I call him and he'll run down his top 10. So here we go with old Mad Bob McKee coming up. Okay, let's have a look at the top ten. What's the number ten this week, Bob? Number ten for us, Bloodstone's Outside Woman. Okay, here we go. We're going to play Bloodstone's Outside Woman for Mad Bob McKee at WAOK in Atlanta, Georgia. I lay next to another woman but I call out your name Yeah, baby And I really want to see you right now But right now I can't change a thing But just remember Sometimes it seems a million years between our little get together. <laughs> oh, yeah. But I know that you know that I know that you think things ain't gonna get any better. Just remember, girl, I love you. And as soon as I can, I'll break away and see you. There you have it, the number 10 this week. Let's go back to the man in Georgia, McKee at WAOK. I'm David Simmons in London, by the way, on Radio 1. The point is at the number 9, the number 8, the number 7, the 6, and we'll play the number 5, Bob. All right. Number 9, main ingredients don't want to be lonely. Number 8 this week, Aretha Franklin's I'm in Love. The Philadelphia Sounds, number 7, that's the... Uh, Soul Train Train, T-S-O-P, and Creative 
source. Who is he? Is number six. This week in the United States of Georgia. Number five in fifth place this week, ladies and gentlemen, it's the Jackson Five with number five dancing machine. Dancing, dancing, dancing. She's a dancing machine. Till the music stops now Yeah Okay, there you have it. Number five this week at uh, WOK in Atlanta, Georgia. I don't know whether McKee is still there in one piece after all that, but you still there, McKee? It's, oh, yeah, uh, uh, in pieces, yes. <laughs> okay, let's have a look at the 432 and we'll play the number one. All right, coming up. Number four, For the Love of Money by the OJs. Number three, it's the Ebony's in I Believe. Number two in Atlanta this week. The stylistics, you make me feel brand new. And here's the one that's at the top of the list. Hey, we do what we call the loose booty dance to this. If you're not familiar with the loose booty, why, uh, you got to put both hands up in the air, do one jump and bump twice. I mean, that's the booty bump, and the way we do it in Atlanta, Georgia, is to the number one tune of the day, James Brown's Paradise.
squealing. I can dig rapping. I'm ready. I can dig scrapping. This record is. But so I dig that backstabbing. Atlanta. Okay, I don't know whether anybody out there was loose booting whilst that was playing, but that was number one, the godfather of soul, brother rap James Brown and his latest single in America, Payback. Okay, uh, brother Bob McKee there, you been playing any blues lately? Yeah. A guy just left town here, his name is Willie Dixon. A guy that's written an awful lot of uh, stuff for Muddy Waters and, uh, oh, uh, Holland Wolf and... That, that crew. He worked up there in Chicago with Chess. Mm. Willie's actually from Jackson, Mississippi. And uh, uh, we've got a club here in town now that it, it's, it's, there are very few brothers and sisters around the club. You understand? Yeah. They, that, it's not a brothers and sisters dish at all, but there's a lot of young white cats and chicks that hang around a place called Richard's here in town. Yeah. And that's where you'll find the blues going on right now. John Lee Hooker's in town this week, and uh, as I say, Willie Dixon was here last week, and Muddy Waters the week before. So uh, uh, with each new uh, artist coming in, I usually, you know, try to pick up on some of the old hits by, uh, well, let's let, let uh, do, do, do you know the big stuff by, uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, Boogie Chillin' Man? And I've been playing Boogie Chillin', been playing, uh, you got dimples when you walk, yeah. Yeah. Stuff this week yeah. John Lee, yeah. in honor of his being here. Okay. Listen, McKee, uh, let's, let's abandon the top ten next week. I'll call you again and uh, pick out three of uh, our kind of music that is beginning to get onto the charts there in Atlanta, okay? Fine. Yes, indeed. Mad Bob McKee from Atlanta, Georgia, radio station WAOK, and we'll ring him again next week. Any of you a bit worried about old McKee there, thinking he's smashed out of his mind? I assure you he is not. He is like that all the time, 24 hours a day, except when he sleeps, uh, which is not too frequently. The only thing that gets old McKee high is good, soulful music, and he gets plenty of that. Now, let's have a look at uh, what's happening in the pop world in America. This week, using the Record World Top 100 Singles Chart. You know, the soul hasn't been doing too well recently, and there are only 10 soul records. I always pick up the top 10 for you, you see. Uh, there are only 10 soul records in the top 33. At number 33, Honey, Please, Can't You See, Barry White. Number 31, Thanks for Saving My Life, Billy Paul. Number 28, Boogie On Down from 16, Boogie Down, Eddie the K. Eddie Kendricks, of course. Dancing Machine, which was number five in Atlanta, is uh, only 26 in the pop charts, but moving up from 33. Dancing Machine and the Jackson 5. Number 23, My Mistake, the dynamic duo, Diana Ross and Marvin Gaye. Leap up now to number 18. They're still in there. Up from 21, Staple Singers and Touch a Hand, Make a Friend. Number 16, Just Don't Want to Be Lonely, which I played about an hour ago. Main Ingredient, released in this country on RCA. The number 11, My Man, Bobby Womack, heading for the top, I hope. Up from 14 to 11 with a bullet, looking for a love. And uh, number four, 
Another leap up from 11 to 4. Best thing that ever happened to me, Gladys Knight and the Hip Pips. Number 2 is TSOP by MFSB, and that's it. The number 1 is still the same, not to my mind, very pleasant record, but there we are. It's a big hit in America. Number 1 is Hooked on a Fleeting Blue Suede, and if that's soul, then... Uh, Mm -hmm. Woo! I think a little of the old Bob McKee juice is seeping through into the cold control room here in Broadcasting House. Right, eight and a half minutes past six, it's the flashback time. We flash back to 1961 and Miss Laverne Baker. <laughs> Won't be your back at all. Ms. Laverne Baker, that's the sort of hit-back section of the programme this week. But in fact, much of the second, uh, no, third part of the programme, let's call it, 11 minutes past six, much of the next part of the programme is in fact composed of oldies. Word from this rockin' bird, Joe Niagara, no matter what they say, rock, rock and, and roll, roll is here, here to, to stay. stay. Remember this one from Richie Valens? Oh.
That's Richie Valens. Arriba, arriba. You're no soy marinero. La Bamba, the B-side of Donna from 1959. It's on an album called Carrots, and the number is MGM 2315280. I warn you, most of the artists would not fit into the, the sort of bag that I'd like to put things in for this show, but uh, there are a few. Richie Valens is one of them. MGM 2315280. If you're ready, this rockin' bird will fly. And indeed we go with something from Mac Curtis that I've never in my life heard of before. But it's rather nice. I once had a shack, but it was nowhere. I heard a knock at the front door, didn't know who was there. I went to the mirror just to brush up my hair. I opened the front door, you should have seen what was there. What you want, 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 baby. All that I can say is what you want. What you want, what you want She was long, lean, and lank And Ooh. white eyes All that I could do was just look and let it size She talked real sweet But all of it was lies Come over here and kiss me I said, ooh, baby, why what you want What you want, 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 what you want, baby All that I can say is what you want what you want, what you want Sort of way you see her kind and nearly every day. They're in my shack and feeling so gay. You can't have my money. Do you still want to stay? What you want? 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 All that I can say Baby, baby, what you want Mac Curtis and uh, What You Want. That's from an album that has Charlie Feathers on one side and Mac Curtis on the other, and uh, it's in mono. Uh, glad to see record companies aren't fooling around anymore, messing records up by uh, stereoizing mono records. The number is Polydor 2310293. And it's called Rockabilly Kings, Charlie Feathers and Matt Curtis. Once again, I've selected, as far as I can tell, there are only a couple of tracks here from either side that would fit into the show, but I've put in what I can. Originally issued by uh, King from Nashville, Tennessee, recorded in Fort Worth in Texas, December 29th, 1957. Matt Curtis, 616. Remember last week I played uh, Steve Miller and a track off his very successful American album, The Joker, Mary Lou. Here's the original by Young Jesse. I'm going to tell you a story about a Mary Lou. I mean, the kind of a girl to make a fool of you. to make a young man groan and a old man pain. The way she took my money was a crying shame. Mary Lou. Mary Lou, she took my watch and chain. Mary Lou. Mary Lou, she took my diamond ring. My Cadillac car Dumped in my kitty and then Drove her far away well, She left from the car to go to Kalamazoo Made her a part the night A fool like you Met her a rich man who was mad And had two kids She smoked that cat until it flipped Till the end Mary Lou, Mary Lou She took my own wife and chain Mary Lou, Mary Lou She took my diamond ring She took the keys to my Cadillac car Jumped in my kitty and then drove her far. Well, I put a detective on her trail. I post office so that they could trace the mail. She got picked up and then was sent to jail. She clipped the judge just to pay a bill. Mary Lou, she took my watch and chain. Mary Lou, she took my diamond ring. She took the keys to my Cadillac car. Jumped in my kitty and then drove her far. Mary Lou! So that they could trace the mail She got picked 
up and then was sent to jail. She looked up just just to pay her bill. Mary Lou, she took my watch and chain. Mary Lou, she took my diamond ring. She took the keys to my Cadillac car. Jumped in my kitty and then drove her far. Well, she came back to town about a week ago. She told me she was sorry she had hurt me so. I had a 55 Ford and a two dollar bill. The way she took that man, she gave me a tear. Mary Lou, she took my watch and chain. Mary Lou, she took my diamond ring. She took the keys to my Cadillac car. Jumped in my kitty and then drove her far. Mary Lou, 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 Mary Lou. Yeah, man, boy, that took me by surprise. And about you, that was uh, Young Jesse and Mary Lou, originally issued on the Modern label from uh, Los Angeles. The Bihari brothers owned that, along with RPM, and it was recorded early '55 in Los Angeles, California, with Young Obadiah Jesse lead vocal, with backing vocals by the Flares or the Cadets. It was remade in '59 by Ronnie Hawkins uh, of Susie Q fame from northwestern Louisiana and uh, I suppose that is the version that Steve Miller must have heard because on the Joker album that Steve Miller has done the writing credits for the song go to Ronnie Hawkins and somebody else whose name I've forgotten but anyway the original was by young Jesse this is off an album on Polydor called Oop Shoot featuring Roscoe Gordon the Jacks young Jesse the Robins great stuff from the 50s even Johnny Guitar Watson whom you may have seen when he came over with Little Richard many years ago. And uh, comes out in May. The number is 2383251. 2383251. Coming up to 621. Of course, the pace of the show has increased somewhat because all the tracks from the 50s are rather short. Some of them are only about 2 minutes and 20 seconds. Uh, time for a little blues before we close the show. We ain't closing yet either. At the Woodchopper's Ball, another Polydor album out next month. This is Joe Hill Lewis.
Joe Hill Lewis recorded in uh, Memphis in February of 1953. That was never issued at the Wood Choppers Ball. Some people might say, yes, not surprised. Joe Hill Lewis on uh, vocal, guitar, harmonica, hi hat. Good God, he's really doing his pieces, wasn't he? That's on an album, Juke Blues, number 11 in the Juke Blues series, also out in May. And it has two artists on Joe Hill Lewis and Willie Nix, Blues in the Morning. On Juke Blues, the number is Polydor 2383. Two, one, four. To close, something nice and sentimental from the Jacks who say, Why don't you write me, darling? Send me a letter. Tell me you love me, dear. Make me feel better. I love you. Yes, it's you I The Jacks and Why Don't You Write Me a Letter. Again on this album, 2383251 on Polydor, called uh, Oop Shoop. A lot of the things would, I suppose, fall on deaf ears here because doo-wop music didn't make it here in this country as it did in America. But uh, there we are. It's nice and it's out very shortly. OK, that's it for another Saturday. The next Wednesday evening I have a big challenge. It's off with the jeans and Judge Dredd T-shirt and on with the black velvet suit and the bow tie and the flashy shoes. I'm comparing an evening of, comparing an evening of Gilbert and Sullivan with the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra, would you believe, at the Royal Albert Hall. That should be uh, uh, something else. And then on to Friday evening, uh, I'm practising at Brands Hatch during the day for a charity race in May. And then in the evening, Carnival comes to Croydon. I'll be using my mate Roscoe's gear for an extra special evening of soul. So don't forget them all. We're going to the dogs next Friday when the Greyhound's in town in Croydon. Friday evening soul. Right now I have to dash from Broadcasting House to Euston Station by a quarter to seven. Or I won't make it to Clandidno Junction tonight on the Emerald Isle Express. Actually, I have precisely 17 minutes. Will I do it? I won't, won't I? Well, if, if you hear extra applause during the in-concert program, you'll know I missed the train and I'm hanging around to the next one. I'll see you again next week at 5 o'clock on Radio 1. For me, Dave Simmons, bye, you all.
This is Radio 1 on 247 Medium Wave and Stereo and Mono VHF. It's 6.30.